Of course, there's the Burj Khalifa, the tallest building in the world. And then there's the iconic Burj Al Arab in the background. Welcome to my home in Dubai. I moved here seven years ago from Johannesburg with my family. My husband was transferred here for work and that's how we got to Dubai. Now we are living in the beautiful suburb of Um Sukim. When we first got here seven years ago, we were the only family that we knew that was keeping kosher. It was quite a daunting time at the time because we didn't know what we could get in Dubai. I went on the hunt for kosher food and I found that in the supermarkets there were a number of imported products. You can get a wide range of goods here in Dubai. This was very surprising to me. I was even more surprised and happy to see a number of kosher products from our own country, South Africa. When people started hearing about us in Dubai, they started reaching out, asking for kosher food. And that's how my service started. I now do food for travelers, businessmen and women, conferences and private events. attached to the synagogue, my husband is the president of the community and I provide catering for the community when it's required. I do food for Shabbat and Chagim and recently over Purim I was sending out Mishloch Manot. There are many great things to do in Dubai. Of course there's the Burj Khalifa, the tallest building in the world and then there's the iconic Burj Al Arab in the background. Dubai has beautiful landscapes and wonderful beaches, water parks for the kids, lots of great activities to do. I've started becoming very involved in the tour industry here, promoting kosher travel. I have developed wonderful partnerships with tour organizers and I provide kosher food for safaris in the desert and also for boat cruises. So definitely join us, there's so much to do here. And now I will show you my kitchen. Follow me. So this is my kitchen. I have two kitchens actually. Uh, my milk kitchen is on this side. As you can see I've got the signage up. This is my milk stove and my milk oven. On that side, over there, this is my meat kitchen. As you can see, it's also signposted. So my meat is produced on this side, in this oven, and on this stove. In Dubai, we don't get much kosher meat, but we do get kosher chicken, and this is where it's produced. I come from a Greek background. So the kind of food that I like to make are very Mediterranean. I love cooking with olive oil, lemon juice, herbs, garlic, very clean taste, very healthy, wholesome food. This is my light box. Uh, this is where I check my green leafy vegetables. The light box was very generously sponsored by Star K, who have been supporting me throughout this process. Star K has been a great supporter of mine and they bring me spices from India occasionally. They come with a Star K Heksha, already ground. These um, I use quite regularly in my cooking and my food. I like to be, I like to experiment quite a lot. This fish is Nile perch, which I buy from the local fish market. I buy it whole with the skin on, just like I do with the sea bass, 
and I have a professional chef who comes once a week to skin my fish in the kitchen. This is an item of my menu called crispy fish strips. So this is rugelach. My children love rugelach, except that in Dubai we can't get kosher rugelach, so I, I make it. And this is a recipe that I've developed, um, and my children love it, and people in Dubai enjoy it too. Um, so I have made three kinds. I make chocolate, cinnamon, dates, and pistachio. This is Ailey's Kosher Kitchen, and I am Ailey. We are in my kitchen in Dubai, and I've produced a wonderful delivery of kosher food, delivering to you anywhere in the UAE. So come to Dubai, because you can continue to eat kosher food here.